priced at just 15,000 rupees, Samsung Galaxy J7 is a very solid contender from Samsung when it comes to performance oriented mid range phones. In this video, we are going to test exactly the same by running benchmarks and playing some very powerful gaming titles on the Samsung Galaxy J7. Let's get started. I'll start by talking about the performance and specifications and the Samsung Galaxy J7 gave us a score of 37,478 on Antutu. On Quadrant Standard, we got a score of 21,730. It comes part with an octa-core chip which is an Exynos series uh, 1.5 GHz octa-core chip which comes with 1.5 GB of RAM. In terms of display, there is uh, a 5.5 inch display on the offer which is a super AMOLED high definition display which produces very good quality colors. It comes with 16 GB internal memory and a slot for expanding the memory with a micro SD card. It is a very well sorted phone when it comes to specs and performance but let's put it to test by playing heavy titles like Modern Combat 5, Asphalt 8 Airborne and GT Racing 2. Let's get started with the gaming. The loading time for the games on this phone is very short and it's much better compared to other phones that we have seen in this price segment. We are playing the Asphalt 8 first and let's find out how it performs here. The phone is not dropping a sweat to play this game. It's playing that, that game with ease and you can see the graphics quality here. It's very very smooth and rich. And we did manage to finish first on this game. And the phone did not uh, heat up, did not stutter and did cooperate fully when it comes to graphics and I'm really impressed with this game. Let's move on to our next game now. And this is the Modern Combat 5 that we have just uh, started. And the graphics here are top notch. Looking superb on the Super AMOLED display. It's a fun to play game and you can see how good the graphics are coming out here. Target eliminated. Confirm extraction location. Over. It's super smooth, there's no frame dropping, it's very very responsive and I totally love the experience that I get on the Modern Combat 5 here. Let's move on to our next game. This is the GT Racing 2 that we are playing here. Let's find out how well this game does when it comes to playing uh, GT racing here. It's a very fun to play game. They claim that it gives you real car experience. That's what they aim to provide you with this. You have to control your brake, steering and accelerator properly to maintain a proper pace as per the track. It's 
not dropping any frames it's playing smooth it's uh, doing very well when it comes to graphics and at the same time it is not heating up so i'm really impressed at the end of uh, this gaming session i want to show you how hot this phone gets and in my experience it does not get uh, very hot it's only 36.2 degrees while many other phones after playing these two three heavy aggressive games would easily reach temperatures of 45 degrees plus and it is well below 40 degrees 38 degrees at max at some points uh, so it is really really cool and very nice when it comes to playing games uh, on the Samsung Galaxy J7 we are really impressed with the gaming performance of the Samsung Galaxy J7 and we would recommend it to you anytime if you want to pick up a gaming oriented phone and you do not have a huge budget at around 15,000 rupees Samsung Galaxy J7 which is a 4G high definition large screen phone comes with a front facing flash as well we'll cover that in our full review in terms of gaming performance it is a full thumbs up from us if you want to pick up one for yourself I'm leaving direct links in the description section below where you can buy one at the best price if you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up by pressing the like button below and for latest video updates and full review of the Samsung Galaxy J7, make sure you hit the red subscribe button and get latest video updates from Intellect Digest. I hope to see you on my next video. This is your host Rohit Khurana signing off. Thanks for watching.